So my pick of the week is this American Sign Language game that was created by Vidget or Vidget. I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Uh, and it is what it looks like. It is a, a sort of a flashcard, visual flashcard learning game that helps you test your knowledge of American Sign Language uh, symbols uh, or learn them. And so let's, let's have a look over here. This is uh, the game itself. You can play it inside the simulator here. I think you can, or it's not playing right now. I'm going to switch over to uh, show it to you running on that little uh, meow bit I showed you before. So you can see here it's got these terrific illustrations of the uh, sign language letters. And then you go through and you pick which letter you think you're looking at and hit A. Uh, I'm wrong. That's not a P. I don't know sign language, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to uh, take some guesses here. Is that a Z? Is it a G? Is it an H? It's going to keep letting me. There we go. It was an H. Uh, I bet that's a X or a W. No, it's a W. I bet that's a W. There you go. Um, so you can see it's a really cool, beautifully illustrated. I don't know the story of it, so I'm going to go on the forums and ask... Uh, vidget or vidget or if you're watching let us know uh, where where this all came from where the illustrations come from where the concept come from because it's uh, it's really terrific and if we look at it uh, back here in Chrome I'll show you uh, a couple of things about the game first of all you can see there's an array of sprites here that are all these letters that are used um, so these sprite arrays are really handy because it allows you to uh, access them with an index so you can pull up five random numbers and it's going to uh, throw those up on the side of the screen. And then it's going to also use this array of these signs. So you can see we've got all these sprites here uh, and these are part of this large array. And so those are selected and then uh, the uh, number of the choice that you pick is correlated to the correct answer and you either lose a, a point or rather lose a, a life, a heart, or you uh, proceed to the next one and gain points. One thing I did, since I don't know sign language, I don't know American Sign Language alphabet uh, other than a few guesses uh, at some things, I changed the number of lives you have to 100. The game starts out as uh, six, but one of the nice things about Make Code Arcade and an open um, platform like this is that you can go and look at the source code, and here I found the set life to um, 100. It was at three. And that allows me to sort of tailor the game to learning rather than testing knowledge. Uh, so I thought that was a really beautifully done uh, game, nicely illustrated, uh, straightforward, great execution. And so that's my arcade game pick of the week. It is American Sign Language Game by Vidget or Vidget.